hey tribe welcome back to my channel i'm coming on here really quickly to give you kind of a life update and just to chat with you guys so as some of you know guys i have taken some time to practice and learn introspective hypnosis i just want to take you through what you might expect um, in the future of this channel and what kind of services i'm going to be offering so basically this journey uh, of mine started some time ago and it started kind of subconsciously let me lower down the uh, music a little bit i was um, i was subconsciously looking for another tool in my basket if you can put it that way in order to help people and i came across introspective hypnosis some time ago and i kind of put it on the back burner um, and I don't want to say I was waiting for a right time, the right time just arrived. I kind of like to take things um, and go with the flow. And I got introduced to one person um, who practices that as well, as you've probably seen Leo, whom I talked to. Um, what I realized very quickly is that that's exactly what I wanted to bring um, as part of services that I offer because over time I've noticed that even in my tarot readings I would want to dive even deeper into the subconscious and even if someone comes to me with certain questions specific questions I would start a reading with energy checkup you know diving into subconscious where should your focus lie you know what is the advice a lot um, a lot of it was based on self-care and that was the part that I treasured the most because when we reflect and we take these things into consideration, we can change a lot of things around. And it's all about the present moment too, right? So for the soul, there is no time. Everything is happening right now. And um, when I went to learn introspective hypnosis, I have booked a course with Antonio Sanjo, who is going to come on my channel and talk us through this. And I want you guys to hear um, everything about introspective hypnosis from him, even though I'm going to be talking about um, it myself and I'm going to be answering your questions. Whoever will want to, or you, if you're drawn to practicing yourself, I highly suggest this. It's a life-changing practice, I call it that way. So once I have finished the course, I then started practicing quite a lot and I wasn't as active on YouTube and I wasn't, I was quite slow when replying to people's messages because when I'm focused, I'm very focused unless there was some type of emergency. And you know, I realized that the same with tarot, tarot and magic and all those, you know, mystical things, there were a lot of myths um, about hypnosis as well. Because when you think about hypnosis, think about something that you saw um, on a TV, right? There was stage hypnosis um, where, you know, people are shown that they can be hypnotized and they do certain tricks. It's just ba basically a quick way of showing people that um, you can affect the subconscious and you can implement certain suggestions. Now, when it comes to the personal sessions, I'd say come with an open heart and open mind, but also be willing to dive deep. Hypnosis is not about... I want to say it's not about being curious what has happened to you, you know in the past life if you go there you are fully in control of the session all i'm doing is navigating you through it and you may end up you know going back to your childhood memory you may end up going to the womb itself where your journey has started or you may end up going to the past life if that's where the symptom lies the client is in full control and they are doing the healing themselves and that's something that i wanted to bring in addition to tarot where the client the customer can experience certain things themselves and add to this journey and see how truly powerful they are and how they can change things around with certain suggestions and um, feeling is healing really so what you do in in hypnosis you go back to certain memories where something is still pending something that hasn't finished something that was traumatic for you and you kind of live it live it through again and you take from it what you need it what you are missing right now or you finish certain things from the past life that are still somehow affecting you right now and we're coming back to the same thing for the soul there is no past or future right for the soul everything's happening now um, therefore 
certain symptoms we're carrying might be from the past lives or from the attachments um, it depends on your case on your story so when i started experiencing what hypnosis is on myself i did come with certain things you know during the interview stage we do the interview and ask you know um, quite personal questions and everything that the client wants to bring to the table and i realized that certain things i didn't even bring up in interview but my soul knew exactly where it needed to go and what's the priority for me to be looked at what kind of symptom i need to look at after hypnosis i i just took some time to reflect and i think that's quite important to reflect because so many more dots will be connected and one day i realized i i don't have certain symptom anymore and sorry if you can hear the construction uh, noise and i was like yeah the human the human being is is very interesting we when we carry certain problem or symptom we notice it very often but since that symptom was gone for me after the session itself i've just noticed that i don't have it anymore i think a week week and a half after the session was done i just had a light bulb moment and i started exploring even more of myself and I booked a couple of more sessions one when the session was with Antonio Sangio himself it was a beautiful powerful session I will talk about it in the future and I think it's important for me to talk about my own experience too not as a as a practitioner only know what it is what hypnosis is but um, to tell you where I went and how how it was for me and how I experienced certain things. I want to be quite open about my journey on this channel because I think certain things that I might be sharing with you uh, might somehow resonate for some of you or give you some type of an insight as well. So I kept exploring, I kept practicing doing hypnosis and I, I started noticing very quickly that people were changing um, certain things in their life. And some of the uh, decisions they were making, they were subconscious and they would catch themselves doing something completely different from what they used to do before. I got amazing feedback from people, which I'm going to be sharing in the future uh, with everyone here. Obviously, whoever will be down to sharing those experiences and their own hypnosis sessions. I see it as, you know, sharing certain personal things or information or what you realize during the session and how things change over time it can be very healing for others as well not only as clients potential clients but also uh, for people who want to practice and who want to learn and i highly suggest antonio sangio as a tutor he's amazing at what he does he's very patient he would answer all the questions that you may have on your mind even if sometimes those questions might be related to something else that he's talking about um, he even would take extra time just to make sure that everyone is clear on a topic. In the future, in this channel, you can expect those both tools that I'm going to be working with. I will still be doing tarot on YouTube as well as private readings. Um, I'm sorry for the construction again, as well as private readings. And I will be doing hypnosis sessions for those who want to dive deep and who want to go on this amazing journey. So thank you very much guys for listening to me and for being a part of my journey. I truly appreciate every single one of you who are following me, especially those who are with me since the beginning of this channel and for your beautiful messages. And hopefully you're going to find it interesting and maybe some of you will want to either learn yourself or you will want to dive deep and book a hypnosis session either with me or some other practitioners out there there are a lot of amazing tools for us to discover so thank you for being part of this and i'm going to catch you very soon bye for now